Hi guys, Jennifer here from Beauty's Virtue. I thought I'd share with you a quick project that I did here. Um, this is like a living locket. It's um, kind of like a copy or mimic of um, Origami Owl. Um, if you don't know what Origami Owl is, they create these lockets that you can wear um, and you can add any kinds of charms and stuff like that. They sell the locket in like black, silver, and gold, and then they have different necklaces you can add and different baubles and charms that you can add to the outside as well. So this is my version of the living locket and I had an inspiration from someone I saw on YouTube. And this is my version. Now, I used this counted cross stitch thing that I got at Michael's in the $1.50 bin. And I took it apart, and this the rim that's like white in there, I painted mine with some rub and buff in silver metallic, and then I just left the outside black. Um, on the back, I covered it with chipboard, and on the other side of the chipboard, I used the Prima romance novel paper, and then I glued it to the back. And then I added, um, I added this sticker, metal sticker that says Cherish, and I added a bunch of different charms. The person I'm giving it to is my pastor's wife uh, for pastor appreciation, and she loves to sing. She's our worship leader, and she loves to wear dresses, and she loves heels, and she's always helping everybody, so she doesn't have a lot of time because she's always contributing her time to the church and the service and to other people. And so I wanted to make this about her, and I put uh, her family, her husband, her two kids, and her birthstone um, are the colors of some of the beads and the rhinestones that I have in there. And um, I put the transparency film, I cut out a circle and glued it to the top, and then this is the black mesh bling uh, that I got in the $1.50 bin at Michael's as well. And um, I purchased the chipboard from Eat a scrapbooking with me. Um, she has really awesome prices on chipboard, and I love the chipboard. And I uh, have used it on many other things as well. Um, I added a couple of baubles with, and pearl beads, and then um, this little flower, and then this charm that says Made with Love. And um, this flower here I made with the stamping up um, clay that they offer, um, air dry clay, and, and then I put some of the um, pearlized smooch accent ink on top and then a little rhinestone in there. Um, I also glued some rhinestones in various areas on the back um, so that, you know, you could always see them. I just thought that was cute, too, because sometimes they'll get lost in all these other beads and you won't be able to see them. But I also have a little dog bowl charm, which is hard to see because there's a bead in it right now. But anyway, um, just thought I'd share my little project that I did. Um, I added a chain to it as well to kind of finish off the look that it, it's actually like a necklace and so if you have any questions or uh, if you'd like to see more videos um, please send me a comment or and subscribe um, 
but I hope you like this. Um, I left it very simple on the outside because that's how the living lockets are. Um, of course, I wanted to add more, but I just left it simple. Um, so anyway, I hope you like it, and thank you for taking the time to watch my video. Blessings.